Hey there YouTube, it's Arbanus69 here again with another Loot Crate. The December's Loot Crate Galaxy theme. For those of you not familiar with Loot Crate, it's a grab bag of geeky stuff sent through the post every month for a nominal fee. If you want to sign up, there's details in the box below there, you can sign up yourself. If not, come back next month and watch me unbox another Loot Crate. So this month's theme is Galaxy. So I'm hoping Star Wars. I've heard we have Galaxy Quest. I'm not sure what we'll get from that. So let's see. First off, we have a t-shirt. For those who watch my channel will know I enjoy t-shirts. <coughs> we have... Seems to be an 8-bit meets NASA. Meets Christmas. Meets everything else. <laughs> but you can get away with this t-shirt wearing it for Christmas or wearing it for geeky stuff. Well, that is a very nice t-shirt. And we have one other item, and that's it. Nothing else in the box. We have a Halo 5 munitions box. Or lunch box. And something inside. We have pop vinyl. Ignoring everything else and going straight for the Luke Craig exclusive and solo snow gear pop vinyl. Oops. And there's the other ones in the box, and the other ones in the series. And solo Princess Leia, Admiral Akbar. And I'm not even going to pronounce the other two because I can't. Let's see. I do like pop vinyls. <clears throat> Sorry about my voice. I have a cold. And there we are. Very, very nice. And for those who have seen the film, New Star Wars will know Han Solo has grey hair in the film. Well, he is much older, I suppose. That's a very nice pop vinyl figure, that one. What else do we have? Star Wars BB-8 socks. I must admit, I was quite surprised watching the film. I was expecting BB-8 to be a bit like Jar Jar Binks. Annoying as hell. It turns out, he wasn't. And there we are. I thought BB-8 was quite a comical, adorable character. <clears throat> so we have bright orange BB-8 socks. No one else. Hmm. Not sure about the Galaxy Quest uh, loot item. I have no use for for patches, but hey. It's a Loot Crate exclusive, it's definitely different. Yeah. Don't really have use for things like the patches or the badges that they tend to, to put in. What else have we got? See that, the Loot Crate Galaxy Pin Badge. And oh, we have one other thing. <clears throat> Halo 5 Supply Pack. Or Xbox One. And that is everything in the loot crate this month. Um, yeah. You have the, uh, the magazine. Shows you everything that was in the crate. And the mega crate costing five grand, they say. Never yet won this. Don't think I ever will win this. And it goes through about Q&A with Chris Lee. Uh, the vinyl bobble head. And other bits and pieces. Alright. That is... an exclusive Halo 5 ammo tin box. I was hoping, honestly, for more loot in the crate. Uh, with it being a December edition, I was hoping to be 
a bit better than it is, but hey. You win some, you lose some with Loot Crate. You can't get everything. So as a recap, we have... T-shirt. The BB-8 socks. The rather nice pop vinyl. The uh, Halo 5 ammo crate. And... Digital download, I don't know, probably a couple of quid if that. So yeah, not fantastic. Oh yeah, sorry, and the and the badge. Well, that's it. December's Loot Crate unboxed. Wasn't the best crate we've had. Like I said, you win some, you lose some with Loot Crate. I prefer, I prefer, oh well, I like t-shirts, I like pop vinyls. Not too sure about the Metal Crate and definitely not too sure about the uh, the digital download code or the emblem badge. But you win some, you lose some. Give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down and let me know in the comments what you thought of the video. It helps me produce better content in the future. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button down the bottom here. And I will see you next month with another Loot Crate. Take care.